you the opportunity to call a huddle. I heard a couple of them. Yeah. Who, called, who called the huddle? She's like, he's got a. Help. We will help you, Logan. What's wrong? What's wrong, buddy? You can't breathe. Okay. Get the oh, yeah. Our top door. Top door. I can't breathe. I want my mom. Someone's going to get you. Go get your mom. Go get your mom. Go get your mom. Who doesn't have something to say? Okay, maybe we can write hey, uh, it. Uh, it's 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 Mother of Logan Williams to Ruby. Mother of Logan Williams to Ruby. Information comes up. Right on fire. Wait, is this one? Say the Bible's on and it'll come up. <laughs> Just all you have to do is hit the water again. Okay. I feel like I can't breathe. I feel really itchy. It's 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 itchy. Go through every single door and do like 
because we kind of forgot what their yeah, label was called, so yeah, we so were so so <laughs> so we tried to get them to go, we got them to figure out what it was and called, so we called Pharmacy, yep. and they said something with an E, and we were like, oh, can you do that? <laughs> <laughs> but we found Benadryl. How was the phone? Did that feel okay? Yeah, they actually put you on hold. It was like music. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They put you on hold. But they answered your question, yeah, and then did. you went to yeah. the appropriate referrals and things like that. You said, I, I think when I answered it was, you know, an emergency, we need another yeah, location. Well, yeah, and yeah. then they did the page out, so hopefully in the hospital that scenario will come, right? Um, excellent. So, airway, just really quickly with our bag oh, masks, we've got a perfect. So, we're missing ah, right here. So, so this is where we can actually connect our oxygen tube, <laughs> and then when we take <laughs> that, take off that oxygen, we'll fix this. It's okay, you're still pushing air. So, really quickly, how, how fast do you guys breathe? Not so if we're doing this, no, yeah, we're going to hyperventilate the other way, right? which sometimes you want to do clinically, but for the purposes of he's not breathing all that well much, we probably want to give him, you know, 20 breaths or a little bit less per minute, right? So we're going to the slower pace. But you did perfect as far as replacing the phone for Casey's now and hoping it's wrong. But that was it. That was perfect. Yeah, we got the little red on fire situation. Yeah, yeah. I like that red on fire. So smoke over smoke fire. Over fire. Oh, right. sure. Whatever. Red is on fire. So we got it right. on fire. Good. So you guys got all your leads on. Yeah. Um, so you feel comfortable there. I, I heard somebody notice like the patient's eyes are closed. Their oxygen is going down. So you want to really keep that up. What's his oxygen at now? That means it's not readable because there's not enough oxygen. Um, what's his heart doing? Oh, his heart is going crazy. Oh, my God. Oh, crazy. It's going crazy. So what we can do is actually get chest compressions at this point. We could also defibrillate. So we could also grab our AED. So if you guys want to go ahead and grab our AED. Oh, they did. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look. Well, it has been like it walked you through it. That was. Did you guys hear that? That was beautiful. Situational awareness and task assistance. Would you like some help? Yes, I would. <laughs> <laughs> but I love that we have somebody from each team yeah. doing it together. So not one team, yeah. ten minute team. <laughs> not for him. Oh. <laughs> don't tell Logan. <laughs> <laughs> don't tell him at yeah. all. So, so don't take the, the plastic off. You're just gonna place that oh, okay. to the patient. So that's the mirror. Yeah. Oh. Right there. Yeah, this is the chest. Yeah. Put the metal. That's not a this is the bead yeah, patient, so it's slightly yeah, different. Yeah, yeah, you want to lift up the bed. Oh, good job, you guys. Oh. Analyzing heart rhythm. Good. <laughs> Sorry, that's my hand. It's okay. Do not touch the patient. Okay. Good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <that's laughs> right. We're right here. We all off the bed. Here. Shock advised. Wait, it'll, it'll tell you what it's going to say. Charging. You're going to make sure nobody's touching the bed. Stay clear of the patient. Clear. Deliver shock now. Press the orange button. Square. Shock delivered. Perfect. <laughs> then you guys want to turn it off. CPR. It's going to keep talking and yeah, telling CPR. you what to do. <laughs> <laughs> but, however, you guys want to check your monitor. Okay? Stay so, yeah. So, really quickly, if you shock, check your patient or check your monitor and see if they've gotten back into a normal mm -hmm. rhythm. If they haven't, do your chest compressions. If they have, <laughs> then so, stop and see what's going on. Just go 92 and Okay, yeah, still he's still he's kind of crazy, so you would, but. All right, guys. Really quickly, I'm gonna t uh, hand this over. Any questions about? Two minutes remaining in your debrief session.
Time is up. Please exit and move to the next room.
don't know how to do it. That's why it's not just straight. And when you do it, it's not just straight, it's like not compatible with what happens in your life. And you know what? You're the one that told me that I was supposed to help you get this. And you don't tell me the truth. Know who I am. I didn't know who I was smoking. Does that sound a little crazy? I mean, I, I'm sorry, but if I wouldn't have been there holding on to you, you would have called me out of the blue. That's how I recall it happening. Learners, you may begin. Learners, you may begin. Show me, let me know when it starts hurting, okay? Okay. So, 
Are you okay, Jordan? I'm just in pain. You're in pain? Okay. What kind of pain do you need? Time is up. Please exit the room and return to your room. All right, you guys can leave everything in the room. And now just go to the store.